right, y'all. Peace and blessings. God bless you all. I'm Jarvis Kingston, and I hope that y'all doing all right, staying strong and solid in these times that we're in. I pray that you have repented and that you were baptized. I pray that you are safe, protected, and prayed up. And I just pray that whatever situation that you're going through, that the Lord is with you, that he guides you, protects you, he looks out for you, he comforts you. I pray that your mental health gets better and that you become more strong and wise in the Lord. I pray that you keep fighting a good fight of faith. You keep running your race. You keep your eyes fixed on the Messiah. You keep your eyes fixed on the prize. You stay on that narrow path and you help out plenty of people along your journey forevermore. Amen. Most definitely, y'all. Always remember that the Lord will never leave you nor forsake you and the Messiah intercedes for you. Okay, so let us always stay grateful, thankful, appreciative. And always take it one day at a time, people. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord, y'all. Let us thank the Lord for another day. Let us thank the Lord for waking us up and giving us another chance to seek his face. Let us thank the Lord for food in our belly, closing our back and the roof over our head. And let us just thank the Lord for protecting us coming in and going out, guiding us through the morning, guiding us through the evening, guiding us through the night, just protecting us in all forms and places. You know, his grace, mercy, his favor, his love. God say thankful for his word. God say thankful for his only begotten son who died for our sins. Amen. His outstretched arm, the mighty hand of God, the finger of God. There's countless of things the Lord has done for us that continues to keep doing for us forevermore. So we just got to always stay praising him and always stay worshiping him forever because he truly is the only one that got us. Amen. There's no other like him. So you always got to give him all the praise, honor, and glory forevermore. Most definitely, y'all. Welcome, everyone. I appreciate all of you for listening and supporting. It means a lot to me. I love you all. Praying for you all. Let us always uplift each other in Christ. Let us always encourage each other in the Lord, y'all. Much love to the brothers and sisters of the faith. Much love to the 12 tribes of Israel scattered all ends of the earth, scattered all four corners of the earth. Much love to the church. Much love to the martyrs and soon to be martyrs. And much love to the great tribulation Gentiles are grafted in of all nations, tribes, languages, tongues, races, kindreds all over the world. Amen. So let's always show love to one another. Always have that unity, harmony, peace, and love. And always stay prayed up together, y'all. Always forevermore. Yes. Praise the Lord. Welcome, everyone, all peoples, all nations, all tribes, all languages, all tongues, all races, all faces, all four corners of the earth, all ends of the earth. Whether you are an Israelite or a Gentile, it is all right. Whether you are chosen or adopted and grafted in, it is all right. Let us gather together and praise the Lord. And let everything that has breath praise the Lord. All the animals, all the trees, all the fishes in the sea, all the birds in the air, the, the birds in the air, the creatures, the beasts, animals, the plants, the mountains. Let all of God's creation praise him. Amen. Hallelujah, y'all. Let us gather together, sing a new song, clap our hands, stomp our feet, praise him. Rejoice, always rejoice. Play an instrument, sing a new song, all of that, people. Serve him with gladness and joy. Worship his spirit and truth forevermore. Cry out to him, do what you got to do, amen. Always got to stay thankful, people. Take it one day at a time. Let us love the Lord our God, Father, of our mind, heart, soul, strength, and might. Let us love our neighbors as we love ourselves. And let us keep doing Father's business and Father's will for the rest of our lives until his son comes back, amen. He has come back like a thief in the night. He has come back at an hour nobody knows but the Father. He has come back for a people who are spotless, blameless, ready to go. Let us be washed up by the water through the word. Let us keep our lamps. Let us keep our oils. Let us stay alert, sober, vigilant, ready, and always ready for Messiah's return. Y'all always got to stay on point. Keep doing the Father's business, Father's will. Keep doing the Great Commission. Keep spreading the gospel. Keep doing the works to keep helping people on this journey forevermore. Keep spreading the word forever. Amen. God, stay on this narrow path forevermore, y'all. Most definitely. Let the Lord keep revealing himself to us more in dreams and visions, encounters, um, communication, confirmations, anyway. Let the Lord keep giving us signs, miracles, and wonders. Let the Most High just keep pouring out his love and his spirit upon us. Let us always keep pouring out his, his word to us, man. Day by day, situation by situation, amen. Let us know the Lord better. Let's get more close to him and seek his face. Draw near to God, he will draw near to you. Let us obey the gospel. Let us obey all the law, statutes, commandments. Let us obey all of God's word. Anything the most has told you personally, uh, according to your life, your purpose, your situation, your gifts, your future, handle that. Honor that and get to it, people. All right. Praise the Lord. Yes, yes, y'all. So today's message, we're going to go through this commentary within the book of First Kings chapter 8, verses 22 through, 30, 22 through 30. Okay. So this is regarding King Solomon. And we'll just read through that, and then we'll read the recommended reading, the full entire commentary. And then from there, we will close out with a prayer. We will close out with a priestly blessing. And we will close out giving all the praise, honor, and glory to the Most High God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. And praise His only begotten Son who died for our sins. Amen. Hallelujah. Y'all praise the Most High. So let us go to the book of First Kings, chapter 8, verses 22 through 30. All right, I'll read the whole rest of it, actually. Solomon's Prayer of Dedication. Then Solomon stood before the altar of the Lord and from the whole assembly of Israel, spread out his hands toward heaven and said, 
O Lord, God of Israel, there is no God like you in heaven above or on earth below. You who keep your covenant of love with your servants, who continue wholeheartedly in your way. You have kept your promise to your servant David, my father. With your mouth you have promised, and with your hand you have fulfilled it, as it is today. Now, Lord, God of Israel, Keep for your servant, David, my father, the promises you made to him when you said you shall never fail to have a man to sit before me on the throne of Israel. If only your sons are careful in all that they do, all that and all they do to walk before me as you have done. And now, O God of Israel, let your word that you promised your servant, David, my father, come true. But will God really dwell on earth? The heavens, even the highest heaven cannot contain you. How much less did this temple I have built? Yet give attention to your servant's prayer and his plea for mercy. O Lord, my God, hear the cry and the prayer that your servant is praying in your presence this day. May your eyes be open toward this temple night and day, this place of which you said my name shall be there, so that you will hear the prayer your servant prays towards this place. Hear the supplication of your servant and of your people Israel when they pray toward this place. Hear from heaven your dwelling place, and when you hear, forgive. All right. All right, so that's a very beautiful thing to say. So we'll just stop it right there. I uh, just want to read the whole entirety of just that section of verse 22 through 30. Very excellent of Psalmist prayer of dedication. Okay, so now let us go through the recommended reading towards this as well. Okay, the recommended reading scriptures is the book of Deuteronomy chapter 6 verses 1 through 9. Love the Lord your God. These are the commandments, decrees, and laws the Lord your God directed me to teach you to observe in the land that you are crossing the Jordan to possess, so that you, your children, and their children after them may fear the Lord your God as long as you live by keeping all his decrees and commandments that I give you, and so that you may enjoy long life. Hear, O Israel, and be careful to obey, so that it may go well with you, and that you may increase greatly in a land flowing with milk and honey, just as the Lord, the God of your fathers, promised you. Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God is one. Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God, the Lord is one. Love the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your soul and with all your strength. These commandments that I give you today are to be upon your hearts. Impress them on your children. Talk about them when you sit at home and when you walk along the road, when you lie down and when you get up. Tie them as symbols on your hands and bind them on your foreheads. Write them on the door frames of your houses and on your gates. Amen. Hallelujah. One of the most powerful commandments to love the Lord your God with all your mind, heart, soul, strength, and might. Very powerful, man. Got to always apply that in our lives. You know, we got to reflect and ask ourselves, are we really loving the Lord with all of our mind, all of our heart, all of our soul, all of our strength, all of our might? We got to examine ourselves, reflect on our habits, our day-to-day living, what we're doing, and ask ourselves, is it aligned with the word, okay? So I speak for myself and anybody listening, okay? All right, so that's the first recommended reading. Now I'm going to go into the second recommended reading scripture. Let's go to Deuteronomy chapter 11, verses 18 through 21. Fix these words of mine in your hearts and minds. Tie them as symbols on your hands and bind them on your foreheads. Teach them to your children, walking about them when you sit at home and when you walk along the road. When you lie down and when you get up, write them on the door frames of your houses and your gates so that your days and the days of your children may be many in the land that the Lord is that the Lord swore to give to your forefathers, as many as the days that the heavens are above the earth. All right, so that's Deuteronomy chapter 11, verses 18 through 21. Now we will go through the book of Ephesians chapter 6, verse 4. Fathers, do not provoke your children. Instead, bring them up in the training and instruction of the Lord. Amen. It's a very powerful one right there. Don't provoke your children, okay? So... Got to be better with parenting out there. Any parents out there, got to be better. How well, you treat your children, always train them up in the Lord and the word and example you said. Okay, so it's very important what rubs off on a child. All right. All right. So now we will get to the actual commentary itself. Okay. The title of this commentary is Like Father, Like Son. If you're a father, have you ever listened to your kids and thought, oh, man, that sounds just like me? Why did the children have to copy that trait? Often it seems that our children exhibit the very qualities we dislike most about ourselves. Negative behaviors easily transfer from us to our children. Children typically seem to possess a strong dose of their parents, for better or for worse. Are you the kind of father who wants to show your children the right way when it comes to the matters of faith? 
Unfortunately, there is no secret formula to passing down a solid spiritual heritage to your children. They ultimately have to grab hold of faith on their own terms and in their own time, or fall flat, sometimes both. While David stands among the great examples of fathers found in Scripture, he certainly wasn't perfect. He failed often as a king, as a man of God, and as a father. He sinned in much the same way he served, with boldness, a wild heart. Yet in some glorious moments, David got things right. That's what his son Solomon wanted for himself. When you lead your children along the paths of faith, you want them to follow. Further, you hope that they will will even discover how to push past your mistakes. However, none of that will happen if you keep quiet about what you believe. If you want your children to make decisions with godly faith in mind, you first need to speak boldly about where you stand. In addition to talking about your faith, show your children how to serve their father, how to serve their heavenly father, their maker joyfully. That involves staying close to the Lord yourself, and it requires putting both your heart and your shoulder into everything you do. God honors his promises and vows to remain faithful to his true servants. You and your children can be a part of God's big, bold plan. Model for your children what it means to live a life of hope and love. Teach them the value of putting God first and pass to them the brightly burning torch of faith. Amen. Things to take away from this commentary. How do you teach your children about faith? In what ways do you set an example of service for your children? What promises would you like to see fulfilled in your children? Amen, people. And we know David's flaws and Solomon's flaws and what have you, you know, but these are examples we can learn from how even people in great positions or great status could even make mistakes and bad choices as well. So um, we have to always understand that, you know, God tests us, God refines us, he purifies us, he corrects us, he straightens us out when we're wrong and what have you. So we have to always keep learning, always be corrected, always be training in the word. Every day we got to be in that word. Every day we got to be repenting. Every day we got to be in prayer. You know what I'm saying? Because this world and the ways of the world, the influences of the world are so filthy, but we also got entangled with it through our own choices and decisions. You know what I'm saying? In certain environments we're in or dealing with, we get caught up in it as well. So we have to always repent, cry out to the most high and um, turn from our ways, you know, do better and fix our errors or what have you. And whatever's out of our control, we trust in the Lord that he'll guide us through it as well along the way. And um thing is me, I'm single with no children. So this is a great read, but, uh, you know, this is more for the parents out there. If you're a parent out there, you're a father, you're a mother, um, you know, raising children these times that we're in a very difficult and intense, um, the, the spiritual attack is hard on the children. Because we know that the Messiah said that the kingdom of heaven belongs to such as these. The Messiah said that the kingdom belongs to the children. And we know that the enemy, the kingdom of darkness, goes after the children and their influence and what have you. So uh, guarding and protecting your babies daily, spiritually, physically, just taking care of them is a, a challenge for many parents. You know, There's a lot of parents out there who might be widows or single parents or... Um, you know, whatever the case may be, at the end of the day, parenting is a hard thing, uh, spiritually, financially, physically, emotionally, all those different things. That's why the prayers got to always be up, you know. You put children into the world, man. Um, got to really guard them with your life, man, protect them from the ways of the world and the influences around them, you know. So it's a huge challenge in the social media era where there's a lot of lawlessness, a lot of just distractions, you know. We live in a very distracted society. We live in a very um, negative world, man. And Teaching children right from wrong, teaching children righteousness and the word of God of faith is is very important. You know, it's even a commandment that um, you teach your children the Torah, you teach your children the, the laws, statute, commandments. That's a commandment itself. You know, teaching your children the word of God, um, everything you do, how it rubs off on them. You know, and even Paul in Ephesians, Paul even says to you know, don't provoke your children. You know what I'm saying? So how we the examples we set to children, how we treat them, how we talk to them, all that matters. You know, so. A lot of people right now are probably battling with parenting or battling with, you know, resentment or whatnot towards their own parents or what have you. Everybody got their own family situations and everything, but we got to handle things by the word, amen, and we got to really apply the word of God to our lives. Um, the Messiah even talked about families and households in the regard of him saying that um, he came not to bring peace, but he came to bring a sword, you know, and how, he's, how he, he prophesied about what Micah the prophet said regarding your own family and household, and he said how he came to put mother against daughter and father against son and mother-in-law against mo- daughter-in-law, you know, all these different things. And then Michael talked about that as well. As, so the Messiah is basically saying how being set apart, sometimes it might even start in the family, it might even start in the home because you might be the only true believer in your household or environment, but others may not believe as you. So it takes, it's a lot of friction and conflict that happens um, with certain people in those situations, you know. So all in all, 
you know, family has always been a very important aspect of the, the word of God and the structure and foundation of it. And even with Joshua, Joshua says, for me and my household, we shall serve the Lord. So to go from Joshua saying, me and my household shall, shall serve the Lord, to the Messiah saying, I came to put mother against daughter and father against daughter, fa- father against son, that just shows you how much the household and the, the family structure has been scattered, broken, and minced down over generations, over centuries, you know what I mean? So, um, you know, the Messiah even said, um, whoever does the will of my father, that's my mother, that's my brother, that's my sister, you know? So... Um, the way the Messiah was breaking it down from a spiritual family to your carnal physical family and how the word talks about it as well is very important. You know, the Messiah said anybody loves their mother, their father more than me is not worthy of me, not worthy of the kingdom. Anybody who loves their sons or daughters more than me is not worthy of me of the kingdom. So we got to understand how the Messiah even also said that if you leave behind mother, brother, sister, land, uh, son, daughter, you leave everything behind for, for my name's sake, for the gospel's sake, you get eternal life in a hundredfold. So we get eternal life and a hundred times what we left behind when we really stick, stay faithful to the Messiah and follow him all the way through. So it's interesting to see the stories and examples throughout the Old Testament, through the scriptures, and then also see the law, such commandments and the gospel all play hand in hand regarding this. You know, David and Solomon were kings, but we were, it, they, they, their flaws and their downfall was uh, visibly shown throughout all Israel. So it just shows you how contagious sin is, how much... Um, it's bad for a king to sin because it rubs off on everybody else and what have you. So the accountability and the standards that we have to live by, man, got to live by God's word all the way through, you know. So this is just a commentary, something we could take and apply to our personal lives, okay. But all in all, prayers for all the parents out there. Prayers up for all of you out there raising children these days of Noah that we're living in. Prayers up, y'all. Prayers for those who... If you're not a parent or what have you, just still prayers up for all of you, you know, because the examples we set, people are watching, and we got to be mindful of how we carry ourselves and what we pass on to other people, all right? So let us take that commentary and apply it to our lives, amen? Amen. So that's the commentary for today. What I would love to do as I close out is give all the praise, honor, and glory to the Most High God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, and praise His only begotten Son who died for our sins, amen? Hallelujah, y'all. So here we go. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord of hosts, the true creator, the almighty. Most definitely his son died for our sins. His blood cleaned up our mess. Yes, yes, y'all. His son is excellent and worthy, man. Very amazing one, you know. Most definitely his son is the last Adam, the second Adam. Praise the most high God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. The God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, the God of Jacob, the God of Israel, the God of Shem. Hallelujah. Praise the most high, y'all. True creator, the advocate, the almighty true living God, the Alpha and Omega. Amen. The apostle of our profession, the arm of the Lord, the atoning sacrifice for our sins, the author and finisher of our faith, the author and perfecter of our faith, the author of life, the author of salvation, the beginning and the end, the beginning of creation of God, the beloved son, the blessing only potent, the blessing only ruler, the branch, the bread of God, the bread of life, the bridegroom, the capstone, the captain of salvation, the chief cornerstone, the chief shepherd, Christ, the Christ of God, the consolation of Israel, the cornerstone, the counselor, Wonderful counselor, the creator, the day spring, the deliverer, the desire of the nations, the door, the elect of God, Emmanuel, the eternal life, the everlasting father, the faith and true witness, faithful and true, the faithful witness, the first and the last, the first begotten, the first born from the dead, first born over all creation, the forerunner, the gate, the glory of the Lord, God, the good shepherd, the great high priest, the great shepherd, head of the church, heir of all things, the high priest, holy and true, the holy one, the hope, the hope of glory, the horn of salvation, the I am, the I am that I am, the I am who I am, the great I am, the image of God, Jehovah, Jehovah, Jehovah Jireh, Jehovah Shalom, Jesus of Nazareth, Jesus, the judge of Israel, the judge, King eternal. He is the king of Israel. Amen. He is the king of kings. Hallelujah. He is the king of kings and Lord of lords. Hosanna, Hosanna of the highest praise, king of saints, king of the ages, king of the Jews, the king, the lamb, the lamb of God, the lamb without blemish, the last Adam, the lawgiver, the leader, commander, the life, the lie of the world, the lion of the tribe of Judah, the living one, the living stone, the Lord, the Lord, our righteousness, the Lord is my portion. The Lord is my strength. The Lord is my rock. The Lord is my salvation. The Lord is my refuge. The Lord is my deliverer. The Lord is my redeemer. The Lord is my healer the sufficient one the sustainer the rest the the, ooh, the provider praise him y'all he is the provider he will keep looking out for us amen he protects his people he look out for us most definitely his words do not fail hallelujah his word does not come back void everything he says will be done amen we definitely agree on that y'all he definitely is the good fortress the high tower most definitely the refuge man he's all of that man he's so much more he's just too amazing name above all names he is my shield he is my buckler 
Lord, the true Savior. Praise him. Yah, Yahweh, Yahuwah, Yahweh, Shai, Yahweh, Be, Yahweh, Yahai, Yahshai, Yeshua, Hamashiach, Barakatha, Shalom, Shalom, Yeshua, Elohim, Yehosha, Yehusha, Yehosha, Ahaya, Yeshaya. He is the consuming fire. He is the father of lights, the father of the fatherless, the father of widows, the father of mercies. He is the God of heaven and earth. His son sits at the right hand of him. The government rests on his shoulders. He's the great physician who can heal all things. He's the carpenter who can fix all things. With God, all things are possible. Nothing is too hard for the Lord. God made everything in six days and rests on the seventh day. He could fix your situation right now in the name of Jesus. We touch and agree. Hallelujah. Praise him, y'all. Call on him. He'll show you great, mighty things, y'all. Call on him, people. Search for him and seek him with all of your heart, people. He is a rewarder to those who seek him diligently. It is impossible to please him without faith. You got to have that faith. Mustard seed faith. Faith, 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 faith. The just shall live by faith. Walk by faith, not by sight. Y'all too distracted by what y'all seeing and what's throwing you off. You better have that firm faith, that unshakable, unmovable faith. Hey, Amen. Hallelujah. Miracles, signs, wonders, healing, deliverance, restorations. Ooh, dramatic turnarounds in the name of Jesus. We touch and agree, y'all. Call on him, y'all. Praise the most high. Call on him. His outstretched arm is going to do it. The mighty hand of God will do it. The finger of God will do it. Amen. We touch and agree. We are in agreement with the Father, Son, Holy Spirit. Praise the most high forevermore, y'all. He is too excellent to even describe, y'all. Praise him. He is the Lord of all, the Lord of glory, the Lord of lords, the man from heaven, the man of sorrows, the mediator of the new covenant, the mediator, the messenger of the covenant, the Messiah, the mighty God, the mighty one, the morning star, the Nazarene, the offspring of David, the only begotten son of God, our great God and savior, our holiness, our spiritual husband, our Passover, our protection, our redemption, our righteousness, our sacrifice, the Passover lamb, the power of God, the precious cornerstone, the prince of kings, the prince of life, the prince of peace, the prophet, the redeemer, the resurrection and life, the resurrection, the resurrector, the life, the revelation, the revelator, the righteous branch, the righteous one, the radiant one, the perfect example, the rock, the root of David, the rose of Sharon, the rule of God's creation, the rule of the kings of the earth, the savior, the seed of woman. The shepherd and bishop of souls, the Shiloh, the son of Abraham, the son of David, the son of God, the son of man, the son of the blessed, the son of the most high God, the source of eternal salvation for all who obey him, the son of righteousness, the just one, the one mediator, the stone the builders rejected, the true bread, the true God, the true light, the true vine. Yes, he is the truth. Amen. He is the way. Hallelujah. He is the way, truth, and life. Praise him. The wisdom of God, the witness, the wonderful counselor, the word, the word of God, the word of life, the word of Yahuwah, the word of Elohim. Most definitely, y'all. Praise him, y'all. The true branch. Yes, divine, all of that, man. It's just too excellent, y'all. Too excellent, people. In the midst of your situation, what you're dealing with and going through, y'all, understand that he is the Lord Jesus Christ, y'all. You always got to remind yourself of how excellent he is. He really gets you through, y'all. We know that his word is purifying silver, just as David said in Psalms. We know that every word of God is pure, as the book of Proverbs says. And we know for sure that his word is a double-edged sword, as the book of Hebrews says. Amen. We touch and agree, so... We got to always, always, always keep doing our thing, people. Always keep doing the thing, our thing for the Lord. The Lord is watching, man. The Messiah intercedes for us, okay? Let's keep making the Messiah happy, amen? Praise the Most High. Keep reminding yourself how excellent and worthy he is, y'all, you know? You got to always remind yourself of that. A lot of y'all be too hard on yourselves and being yourselves down too much. You got to look up and just praise the Lord. Just stop what you're doing. Give him some praise and call on his name. Scream, help me. Lord, I need you. Something. Shout, scream, yell, call on him, people. Amen. Hallelujah. He is the Lord Jesus Christ, the Lord of all. The abiding son, the abolisher of the enemy, the abundant grace, abundant life, ancient of days. Adonai, advocate, Aleph and Tau, Alpha and Omega, altogether lovely. Amen. Anchor of souls, angel of God, angel of his presence, angel of Jacob, angel of the Lord, anointed king, anointed one. Anointed of the Holy Spirit. Anointed preacher, anointed witness, anointed of my head, another king, another priest, anthem of a new song, apple tree, appointed heir, appointed judge, appointed of God, appointed sacrifice, appointed of seasons, approved of God, ark of strength, arm of his strength, arm of redemption, arm of the Lord, armor of God, assurance of our hearts, a stonied one. Author, finisher of our faith, author of eternal salvation, arrow of conviction, author of peace with God, author of the book of life, availing shield and buckler, baby of Bethlehem, baby and child of promise, balm of Gilead, banner of Israel, banner of love, baptizer, bearer of the seven stars, beautiful and glorious branch, beauty of holiness, beauty of the Lord, beginning and ending, beginning of wisdom, beloved white and ruddy one, beloved of the father, beloved son, better than angels, blessed and glorious lamb. 
blessed and only potent and blessed and glorious name, blessed lamb of glory, blessed one, blessed rock, blessed of the children, branch, branch of righteousness, bread, bread of heaven, bread of God, bread of life, breastplate of our righteousness, bridegroom, bridegroom lamb, bright light of glory, brightness of his glory, brightness of the Lord, brightness of thy rising, bringer of good things, brother of James, buckler to the upright, buckler to all, builder and maker, builder of the church, bruised and afflicted of God, bruiser of Satan, captain of salvation, captain of the Lord's host, carpenter, carpenter Jesus, carpenter's son, chief cornerstone, chief shepherd, chiefest among 10,000, child Jesus, child of the Holy Spirit, chosen of God, chosen stone of God, Christ Jesus, Christ Jesus the Lord, Christ of God, Christ our life, Christ our peace, Christ the crucified, Christ the King of Israel, Christ the Lord, Christ the rock, Christ the son of David, Christ the son of God, Christ the son of the blessed, Christ the first fruits, cloud of the Lord, cluster of the campfire, comfort of the mourners, comforter of Zion, compassionate shepherd, consuming fire, confidence, conquering lamb, consecrated son, consolation of Israel, complete controller of all, completer of the saints, contradiction of sinners, counsel of the Most High, covenant of the people, covenant of promise, convert from the storm, creator of Israel, creator of the new heavens and earth, creator of principalities and powers, creator of the earth, creator of the heavens, creator of visible and invisible things, creator of the winds, crown of glory, crown of pure gold, darling, day's man, day spring from on high, day star, defense, deliverer, deliverer to Zion, deliverer of my soul, designer of the universe, desire of all nations, desire of our soul, desire of the bride, desire of the prophets and kings, desire of the righteous, desire of women, despise and rejected one, despised of the people, due of youth, due unto Israel, diadem of beauty, disallowed stone, door of faith, door of the sheep, dweller of the heavenlies, El Shaddai, enlarger of God, elect of the Lord, Elohim, enlarger of my heart, enlightener of my darkness, ensign, ensign for the nations, ensign of the people, enthroned priest, equal of God, establisher of the ends of the earth, eternal Christ, eternal life, eternal word, Eucharist of our faith, everlasting God, everlasting King, everlasting name, everlasting priest, ever living intercessor, ever living one, ever merciful one, exalted and extolled servant, exalted, uh, exalted God of salvation, exalted lamb, exalted name, exceeding joy, our God, our sure reward, <whistles> excellency of God, excellent, Excellent and comely one, executor of judgment, executor of righteousness, expectation of David, express image, eye of the Lord, face of God, face of the Lord, fairer than children of man, faithful, faithful ambassador, faithful creator, faithful Lord, faithful and just forgiver, faithful witness, faithfulness, father of the fatherless fellow, first and last, first begotten, first begotten from the dead, fire of Zion, firstborn, firstborn among many brethren, firstborn from the dead, firstborn of every creature, firstborn son, first fruits of them that slept, first love, excellence of God, foreordained eternally, forerunner, former of all things, former of Jacob and Israel, former of the light, fountain of Jacob, fountain of the house of David, framer of the worlds, free gift, friend, friend forever, friend of Abraham, friend of public and his sinners, fruit of the earth, fruit of the womb, fullness of the father, fullness of the Godhead, gardener of earth, gather of the winds, Gentile trust, gift of God, giver of secrets and treasures of earth, giver of the good spirit, giver of the Holy Spirit, gladness of the nations, glorious arm, glorious honor of thy majesty, glorious Lord, glorious voice with us, glory of God's majesty, glory of Israel, glory of the Gentiles, God blessed forever, God manifest in flesh, God of David, God of great kindness, God of pardon and new life, God of righteousness and wrath, God of just run, God our Savior, God with us, God is with us, good good and upright, good Lord, good shepherd, good teacher, good man of the house, governor, governor of many nations, gracious God, gracious Lord, gracious and full of compassion, great counselor, great door, great God, great high priest, great king, great Lord, great one, great peace, great prophet, great savior, great shepherd, great and excellent, wonderful, amazing, fabulous God, greater than Abraham, greater than Isaac, greater than Jacob, greater than Jonah, greater than David, greater than Noah, greater than Solomon, greater than our hearts, greater and more perfect tabernacle, great of excellency, greatness of might, greatness of strength, greatness of thy power, greatness of Zion, green tree, guarantor of our security, guarantor of the new covenant, guarantor of the tree of life. Guide for us, hand of the Lord, hanged redeemer, harmless, hated one, hater of iniquity, head above all, head of all principality and powers, head of every man, head of the body, head of the corner, head of the church, head over all, head over things, healer, healer of broken hearts, healer of souls, healer of wounds, health of my countenance, hearer of prayer, help of his countenance, helper of the helpless, heir of all things, hidden God, hidden manna, high above all, high and lofty one, high God, high Lord, high priest of good things, high priest of our profession, high priest over house of God, high right hand, high 
high tower of mine, higher than heavens, higher than kings, highest one, his brightness, his dear son, his excellent greatness, his holiness, his holy arm, his loving kindness, his mighty hand, his right hand, his son, Jesus Christ, his son, our Lord, holier than thou, holy and true, holy child, Jesus, holy Lord God, holy name, holy one, holy one and just, holy one of God, holy one of Israel, holy one of Jacob, holy one of Mount Paran, holy thing, honorable lamb of glory. Honored son, hope in the day of evil, hope of David, hope of eternal life, hope of glory, hope of his people Israel, hope of Israel, hope of righteousness, hope of the promise, hope and joy of Abraham, hope and joy of Simeon, horn of David, horn of salvation, horn of the house of David, horn of the house of Israel, horn of my salvation, Hosanna of the highest praise, house of defense, humbler of the high minded, husband of Israel, husband of the bride, that I am, that I am, that I am, that I am who I am, the great I am, the image of God, image of the believers, image of the father, image of the invisible God, Emmanuel, God is with us, immortal, incarnate God, infinite one, inheritor of all nations, inheritor of my mountains, intercessor of sinners, Jasper and Sardin stone, jealous God, Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ, our Lord, Jesus Christ, our Savior, Jesus Christ, the righteous, Jesus of Galilee, Jesus of Nazareth, Jesus, the crucified, Jesus, the grace and truth, Jesus, the king of the Jews, the God of Noah, Job and Daniel. Ooh, praise the Lord. Jew, judge, judge among nations, judge of all the earth, judge of Israel, judge of quick and dead, judge of the fatherless, judge of widows, justify of the spirit, justifier of the circumcision, justifier of the seed of Israel, just God, just Lord, just man, just one, just savior, keeper of Israel, keeper of the covenant and mercy, keeper of the keys of hell and death, kindler of Tophet, king beautiful, king eternal, king forever, king of all the earth, king of glory, king of heaven, king of Israel, king of Jacob, king of kings and Lord of lords, king of nations, king of peace. King of righteousness, king of saints, king of the Jews, king of truth, king of Zion, kinsman nearer than I, kinsman redeemer, Kodashim, holy one, Korban, sacrifices, lamb, lamb of God, lamb of, uh, lamb of Mount Zion, lamb of the 144,000 sealed Israelites of the 12 tribes of Israel, lamb of salvation, lamb of the great multitude, lamb of the 12 apostles, lamb slain from the foundation, lamb to the slaughter, lamb without spot and blemish, lamp, lamp of the feet, last Adam, leader and commander, life, life of man, lifted and exalted son, lifted up suffering symbol, lifted up my head, light and truth, light everlasting, light and darkness, light of heaven, light of Israel, light of life, light of men, light of the city, light of the Gentiles, light of the glorious gospel, light of the glory of God, light of the path, light of the world, light of thy countenance, lily among thorns, lily of the valley, lion of the tribe of Judah, lion of Zion, living bread, living redeemer, living savior, living stone, long suffering God, Lord and Christ, Lord and God, Lord and shepherd, Lord from heaven, Lord God, the holy prophets, Lord God of Mount Sinai, Lord Jesus Christ, Lord Jesus Christ, Lord of glory, Lord Messiah, Lord most high, Lord Yahuwah, Yahweh Shai, Yahweh, everlasting strength, Lord of a new covenant, Lord of all, Ahiah, Ahiah Shai, Lord of all, Lord of David, Lord of glory, Lord of heaven and earth, Lord of hosts, Lord of kings, Lord of lords, Lord of peace. Lord of heaven's riches, Lord of the harvest, Lord of the Sabbath, Lord of the scriptures, Lord of the second advent, Lord of the whole earth, Lord our hope, Lord our judge, Lord our king, Lord our Lord, Lord our maker, Lord our righteousness, Lord our shield, Lord over all, Lord the God of hosts, Lord the judge, Lord thy creator, Lord thy redeemer, thy redeemer. Lord, thy redeemer, Lord, thy savior, love of righteousness, magnified Lord, magnified name, majesty, maker of all things, maker of Israel, maker of morning darkness, maker of one new man, Whew. maker of peace, maker of the new way, maker of the path in the sea, man, Christ Jesus, man of God, man of sorrows, man of thy right hand, man of war, man of from heaven, marred one. Master in heaven, master of the house, master of the sea, mediator of a better covenant, mediator of the new covenant, mediator of the new testament, mediator between God and man, meek and lowly Jesus, merciful and faithful high priest, merciful God, messenger of the covenant, Messiah, Messiah the prince, mightier than the mighty waves, mightier than the noise of any waters, mighty and strong one, mighty arm, mighty God, mighty hand of God, mighty man, mighty one of Israel, mighty one of Jacob, mighty power, mighty savior, mighty strength, mighty wisdom, mind of the Lord, mind anointed, mind elect, mind holy one. Minister of the circumcision, minister of the sanctuary, minister of the true tabernacle, most holy, most mighty, most upright, mystery of godliness, narrow gate, Nazarene, near Lord, obedient son, offspring of David, ointment poured, 
true one, the only one, the one and only sacrifice, one Lord, one shepherd, only rock, ordained lamp of the anointed, ordained of the Father, ordainer of the preachers, our King, our Lord, our Passover, our peace, our Sabbath, our sin offering, overcomer lamb, overcomer of the overcomers, overcomer of the principalities, overcomer of the world, overseer of the congregation, pattern of the believers, peacemaker, perfect peace, physician, great physician, excellent physician, wonderful position, physician. Pierced Messiah, pierced one, pillar of fire, plant of renown, pleased of the Father, polished shaft, portion of Jacob, portion of the land of living, portion of my inheritance, possessor of heaven and earth, potent, potter, power of God, powerful and rich lamb, praise of the children, praise of the saints, preacher of good things, preacher of righteousness, precious lamb, precious Lord, precious stone, preeminent one, preparer of heavenly places, preserver of men, preserver of saints, preserver of the word. Mm -hmm. Preserver of the faithful, preserver of his creation, priest, priest forever of Melchizedek, prince of life, prince of princes, prince of the kings of the earth, prophet of his brethren, prophet from Nazareth of Galilee, prophet mighty deed and truth, propitation for sins, propitation of our faith, proverb to his people, pure one, quickening love, quickening spirit, quickening word, rabbi, rabbani, rabbani. Ransom for all, recompenser, reconciler of enemies, reconciler of things earthly and heavenly things, re redeemer and forgiver, redeemer of Abraham, redeemer of Israel, redeemer of souls, redeemer of the first testament, redeemer of Zion, redeemer the holy one, redeemer the lamb, redeemer the Lord of hosts, redemption, refiner and purifier, refuge for the oppressed, refuge for us, refuge from the storm, refuge in a day of affliction, refuge in trouble, reigning lamb, reproach of men, Rest for our souls, restore of Zion, reject the stone of builders, resurrection and judge, resurrection and a life, revealer of secrets, revealer of counsels of the heart, revealer of the hidden mystery, revealer of the hidden things, reverend, rewarder of servants and prophets, righteous, righteous and very faithful testimony. Right hand of David, right hand of my righteousness, righteous branch, righteous God, righteous judge, righteous man, righteous one, righteous rock, righteous servant, risen light, risen Lord, river of waters, rock higher than I, rock of Israel, rock of my refuge, rock of my salvation, rock of offense, rock of the church, rock of the wilderness, rock and fortress, rock our God, rock the Lord, rod and branch, rod of his mouth, rod of my anger, rod of my strength, rod of that inheritance, root of David, rose of Sharon, rule of Israel, rule of the 24 elders, salvation of all nations nations, salvation of God, salvation of the daughters of Zion, Samaritan, help the Samaritan woman, same Lord over all, same stone of prophecy, same yesterday, today, forever, same word of eternity, sanctified and sent one, saving health, saving strength of his anointed, Savior, Savior Jesus, Savior of all, Savior of the body, Savior of the lost, Savior of the world, scepter out of Israel, scorned one, searcher of hearts, second man, secret of thy presence, seat of Abraham promise, seat of Adam humanity, seat of David kingship, seat of God deity, seat of Jacob nationality, seat of Judah tribe, seat of Shem race, seat of woman prophecy. Amen. We touch and agree in the authority and power in the name of Jesus Christ. You are healed, renewed, restored, redeemed, forgiven, embraced, loved. New mind, new heart, new soul, new hands to prosper, new footsteps, new path, new journey, new good news, new results, new blessings, new results, new new mind, just new everything, new attitude, new outlook, new habits, new routines, new friends to fellowship, new new place, new scenery, new everything. Become a new creature in Christ. Be born again of spirit and water. Repent, get baptized, start your life with from the most high. Get on that neural path and stay on that neural path forevermore, people. Healing, restoration, deliverance. Store up your treasures in heaven, people. Start your treasures in heaven. Prayers for those prayers for those to have their names written in the Lamb's Book of Life. Prayers for those to have their name written in heaven. Prayers for those to have everlasting joy. Prayers for those to have the tree of life. Prayers for those to sit at the table, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Prayers for those to have eternal life in a hundredfold. Prayers for those who get to hear the, the amazing words, well done, good and faithful servant. Prayers for those who get to have the tree of life. Prayers for those who have the heavenly crowns. Prayers for those to obtain the crown of life and the crown of rejoicing. All the things, oh, store up your treasure in heaven. Prayers for those to have the mansions that the Messiah and the Father promised to us, okay? Prayers for those to have the place prepared that the Messiah has prepared for us. He said, I prepare a place for you, amen? So let us strive towards that. Let's get to the prize. Let's stay on that narrow path forevermore, people. Let's, have, let's get to it. Eternal blessings, everlasting life, e everlasting blessings, everlasting promotions, spiritual promotions. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord, y'all. The most high so much thing is stored for you. When we stay faithful to him forever, people stay faithful all the way. So you can hear, well done, good, faithful servant. That's the best amazing validation you could ever hear or receive. Amen. Praise the Lord, y'all. Praise him, y'all. Praise him, praise him, praise him. Hallelujah. It's very excellent, wonderful. 
Gotta embrace some more people. Gotta do I know our situations are what we're going through, but the Lord is with us, people. Praise him. He is a seeking shepherd, the self existent one, separate from sinners, servant, servant of ruler, servant of the Father, servant of the Lord, shade upon thy right hand, shadow of a great rock, shadow of his hand, shadow of mine hand, shadow of the Almighty, shadow of thy wings, shalom of God, Shekinah glory, shelter, shelter of his flock, shepherd of Israel. Shepherd of souls, shepherd of the flock, shepherd of the little flock, shepherd of the other sheep, shepherd of the sheep, shepherd of tender compassion, shepherd lamb, shepherd of the valley, shield for me, shield of thy help, Shiloh, shorn lamb, sign spoken against, silent and meek lamb, sin bearer, sinless high priest, sinless one, sir, slayer of the enemy, smitter of the nation, smitten judge of Israel, smitten rock of Horeb, smitten, sh- smitten shepherd, smitten of God. Son of man, sower of the word of God, spirit of Christ, song of drunkards, son from heaven, son of David, son of freedom, son of God, son of Joseph, son of man in heaven, son of man, the savior, son of Mary, son of peace, son of the father, son of the free woman, son of the highest, son of the living God, son of truth, son over his house, spiritual drink, spiritual meat, spiritual rock, spoiler of the principalities, spokesman of the father, sprinkler of nations and kings, star out of Jacob, stay, stiller of the raging sea. Stone cut with thy hands, stone of Israel, stone of stumbling, stone the builders rejected, stranger and alien, strength and song, strength in time of trouble, strength of Israel, strength of my heart, strength of my life, strength of the children, strength of the Lord, strength to the needy, strength to the poor. Stretched out arm, outstretched arm, strong arm, strong habitation, strong arm, strong hand, strong Lord, strong redeemer, strong power, strong rock, strong hold, strong tower, stumbling stone. Son of righteousness, sure foundation, sure mercies of David, sure steadfast anchor, surety of a better testament, surety of David, sustainer, sword of thy excellency, tabernacle, tabernacle of God, teacher from God, teacher of David, teacher of my path, tempest of hail and destroying storm, temple, temple of the city, tender plant, excellent, amazing, wonderful God, excellence of the kings, testament of prophecy, testator, testimony of the scriptures, that bread, that eternal life, that one from the beginning, that prophet, that rock, the creator, the everlasting arm, the excellent delight, the glorious honor of thy majesty, the glory of their strength, the grace of God, the highest, the just justification of life, the justification of many, the king, the Lord, my hiding place, the Lord, my helper and deliverer, the love of God, the man, the manifest life, the mercy of the most high, the mighty of Jacob, the rock of our salvation, the savior, the victory, the savior of the upright hearts, the savior of upright hearts, the secret of the Lord, is the son of the Lord God, the song of Moses, the sower, the straight gate, thine holy one, thresher of wheat and chaff, throne of God's holiness, thou Christ, tower of David, tower and fortress, tower of salvation, trample of the young lion and dragon, treader of the angry waves, treader of the high places, treader of the lion and adder, treader of the winepress, thy glorious name, thy kindness and marvelous comfort, thy comp- thy staff and comfort, thy praise, treasure of wisdom. Treasure of wisdom, tried stone, triumph Christ, triumph overcomer, triumph lamb, true and faithful witness, true and righteous judge, true bread from heaven, true God and eternal life, true light, true vine, truth, uncorrupted and glorified one, uncomprehendable light, undefiled, unknown God, God works in mysterious ways, hallelujah, unspeakable gift. Upholder of all things, uphold in right hand, valiant right hand, veiled to the new and living way, very beautiful king, very Christ, very foundation of the church, very God of peace, very great, very high, very high priest, very high servant, very lovely song, very present help, very pure word, victorious king and Lord, victorious Lord Jesus, victorious one, victory. Vine, voice of great thunder, voice of many waters, voice of the almighty, voice of the Lord God, wall of fire. Water of life, way, way everlasting, way of salvation, way of the just, way of the Lord, way to the holiest, weakness of God, well-beloved of God, well-beloved son, white linen of the saints, white stone, wisdom, wisdom and knowledge, wisdom of the just, wise and strong lamb, witness, witness of the father, witness of truth, witness to the people, wonderful counselor, word, word made flesh, word of God, word of his power, word of life, word of righteousness, word of the Lord, worshipful Lord, worthy lamb of heaven, worthy Lord Jesus, worthy redeemer, worthy servant, wounded one in house of friends, wounded one for transgressors, yoke of peace and rest, young child, zeal of the Lord of hosts, zealous one, hallelujah, praise the most high, forever y'all he gets all the praise on the glory forever y'all praise him praise him praise him his son died for our sins we should be rejoicing about that every day thank you lord thank you thank you thank you that's all you got is just just thank you everybody complaining all negative and ungrateful and we got so much to thank the lord for amen so always keep that in mind y'all so there you have it all right now what i would love to do as i close out 
is give y'all the priestly blessing, all right? And just, you know, just another prayer. Just prayers up for those parents out there, man. It's so crazy and hard to raise these children out here in these times that we're in, you know. But you got to hang in there, man. You and your babies got to pray. Pray with your children in that household. And, you know, if, you know, if you ain't got children, you'll pray for your nephews. Pray for your nieces, man. Pray for your neighbor's children. Or, you, you know, man, just we got to be more community-minded people, okay? We got to stop being so, uh, you know, independent and so... Uh, isolated you know we we got to come together for people for the lord man we got to be together for god people all right god loves when people are together as a whole okay so let's always be gathered people forevermore okay the lord bless you and keep you the lord make his face shine upon you be gracious to you the lord lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace shalom jarvis kingston love you all praying for you all peace